Okay, a quick review of this little music player. It's a digital music player, MP3 player by WeeWoo. Uh, I picked this up on Amazon. It was right around, I think, 70 or 80 bucks. Um, looking for a way to listen to music while I'm working uh, during the day. It says music, it says it does video. We'll talk about that. Uh, it doesn't actually. FM radio, voice recorder, uh, photo gallery, you can keep photos in it, file browser, tools, settings, and micro SD card extension. So this particular model is the 16 gigabyte MP3 player. Um, it's expandable up to 128 gigs, I believe they said. Yeah, there it is, 16 megabyte or 16 gigabytes, with expandability of 128 gigs. Um, that's pretty good. So the product sizes are there. We'll verify all that. We'll weigh it and do all that fun stuff. Charging time is 2.5 to 3 hours. Um, photos it supports JPEG, bitmap, and GIF. Video is AVI and AMV, 240 by 320. Um, MP or sorry, the music. Uh, formats are MP3, WMA, WAV, APE, FLAC, OGG, AAC, LC, M, 4A, A, C, E, L, P. I don't know what any of those are. I use MP3, uh, WMA, and WAVE. Those are my three that I use. Ebook, it supports TXT, which is a text format. Um, so there's no USB wall adapter for this. Um, micro SD is not included, and please don't let your children under three swallow this thing. I guess that's good. Warranty, 12 months, that's pretty good. Um, you probably have to sign up with them for that. Go to their, send them an email or go to their website. Let's get right to the heart of the matter and open this sucker up and see what's inside. So, this is what comes in the box. There is a nice little armband, actually. You can put it on your arm and run with it or something. And there's a instruction manual. We'll get to that in a second. Go through this: English, German, French, Italian, Spanish, and Japanese. Um, so it's going to go through the basic functions of it, um, all the diagram to show uh, what all the various buttons are, etc., etc., how to turn it on and off, uh, low battery, uh, all this stuff is in here. So it looks to be fairly complete in the. Um, manual department so it has here's go through how to get through all of your settings has an alarm and then troubleshooting and finally customer service before it switches to German the next language uh, there's also a warranty card in here so you'll probably have to sign up for the one year warranty through that on this card so keep that uh, there is a USB cord in here so not sure about that we'll see what that does there's a male male 2.5 mil um, plug here and that'll be good for plugging into your car or another stereo you can play it on that's good and then it comes with oh it comes with some earphones with some extra earbuds there as well so i'll be trying those out and see how they work let's get rid of the plastic piece we don't need anymore and here is the player itself so it's quite nice actually very small it's smaller than i imagined i guess um, no battery compartment on the back it's all internal I've already gotten it dirty. There you go. Fingerprints all over it. So on the one side we have volume control, volume up and volume down. And then there's a uh, lock and power button. On the bottom is your USB plug. That's where this is going to plug in presumably to charge it. If I get it the right way around. There you go. And there's a microphone on the bottom as well as the headset adapter. And that's where you'll plug in either your earphones or this 2.5mm um, extension. And then there's also a small speaker on the bottom. So. Let's hold down the power button and see what happens. Wee woo, there it is. Let's zoom in a little bit. And you can see the interface of this thing. So it's fairly straightforward, I believe. Um, I've played with this a little bit, actually. This isn't the first time I've opened it, so sorry to disappoint, but that is the reality of it. So there's a few things. There's your recorder, uh, calendar, uh, uh, there's a timer there. There's music, there's settings, um, Bluetooth, connectivity, files. And uh, there's your FM radio, a clock, another, what is this? Oh, this is your standby screen, that's right. Um, and then this is where you'd read your ebooks. I don't have anything in there, of course it says, so what does it say? Empty disk. It is empty, yes. So the, oh, the SD port is over here. I forgot to mention that. Here's the SD port, and that'll take a micro SD card, just very similar to this one not included with this. So that's going to slide right in there up to 128 gigs of expandability. So to get into the menus here, what we're going to do is let's jump right into recordings. So you can start a new voice recording, recordings library, or record format and record settings. Let's just do a new, start a new voice recording. So you just touch it and it starts 
recording slow there it is it's recording so there you can see it's recording through this little microphone in the bottom um, and I've recorded a couple things the quality is actually quite good uh, it records in stereo and the quality is quite decent so that's that to get out of this we stop it and stop it and we swipe left and do you want to save this recording well no I don't swipe left will take us back to the main menu and we're on to the next menu we'll go into settings quickly so you can see the language display settings LED indicator um, power off sleep timer date and time information and that's the device information format device that would be clear uh, all information or that would be erase all of your recordings factory settings would be back to the factory settings so go back to the main menu uh, connectivity with Bluetooth so you can connect a pair of Bluetooth headphones to this I have nothing well maybe I have nothing currently uh, I don't think I do so we'll just stop that and go back um, no device yeah that's right so search for device Bluetooth switch control and device list so if I had a pair of Bluetooth headphones which I don't currently have with me then I could attach them that way and that's a great way to listen to music without having a wire uh, going into your files going into files you have JPEG, I have a few JPEGs in there um, they've already got some preloaded music on there so you can see all of the music and there you can hear it, let me turn it up so be careful it's loud it says in symbols So there you go, it's, it's, it's okay quality, I mean it's a tiny little speaker down there, so you can't expect much. Um, it really wants to make sure that I know that that's dangerous to listen to it that loud. So we'll go back, um, JPEG, disconnect the Bluetooth and continue, yes please, apparently we have the Bluetooth still on. So there's a JPEG photo, so you could keep photos on this thing. Um, JPEG number two, what is it of, oh it's a beautiful lake, and these are, these were included with the machine, or with the device to kind of show that you can keep some photos on there so that's pretty neat um, I haven't been yet able to put videos on this thing and I don't know um, if I'm doing something wrong so I'll look into that and maybe add something in the description here's the FM radio so we're gonna go auto-tune and it'll start do you want to auto-tune the presets ah uh, sure so it's going to do a search, connect the headphones, ah, then I remember this, so you have to use the headphones because they are actually an antenna in addition to um, uh, headphones. So the this won't pick up anything because there's no antenna currently. So let's set that down, open the antenna, or headphones. Okay, so let's do that again, let's go back and we'll plug in the hearing and you can hear, I don't know if you can hear that but there's just static on there so we'll click on auto-tune and it'll say auto-tune the presets, we'll say yes please and connect the headphones as we're in an antenna and there we go we're off to the races so let's see, I'll extend these out so they have a better antenna so right now it's presumably scanning our local radio stations and programming them in for me Okay, I'll be perfectly honest, I sped that up a little bit. That only took about 15 or 20 seconds. But now you can see at our local area here, which is Edmonton, Alberta, Canada, um, it has programmed in 12, 18, tw uh, there's 23 local radio stations. Didn't know that because I didn't have one of these to do that before. That's really cool. So now it has all of the radio stations here in Edmonton. You can choose them like 100.3 The Bear, um, and it's playing it right now. Boom. That's pretty neat as a radio player. I'm going to like that more than I thought I would, actually. All right, let's... Oh, that moves it forward and back. So let's stop that. Go back. Go back. Go back. All right, so we've closed the radio app. What else can we show you here? I don't have any audiobooks loaded on here. Here's a alarm, you, so you could set up an alarm. Alarm cycle, alarm music, alarm volume, so it, it does quite a few things there. Um, we'll go back, and what is this in here? This is your kind of your sleep screen, shows your clock and stuff. Um, when this thing goes to sleep, this is 
it'll go to sleep naturally in a few seconds here. It'll go blank. Um, and so that's about it for this thing. Music, Bluetooth, we've gone over most of that stuff. Uh, I like it so far. Here's a calendar. Here's a calendar uh, coordinated to your local time zone. I haven't set up the time, obviously, because it is not May the 4th, 2020. Um, you can move, oh, you can move through the calendar, presumably. Let's see. Oh, yeah, you can move through the calendar by swiping left or right. No, nope, by only swiping right. Because left takes you out. Okay, so that's about it. Back to the main menu. Um, you know what, for, what was it, 70 bucks, 80 bucks, I think this is a pretty good deal. To turn it off, you're just going to hold this button down until it says um, green for on or red for off. So you hit the off and wee woo, it goes away. So that's it in a nutshell. Zoom back. So if you're looking for a little mp3 player that comes with a, an alarm, a, um, a radio station thing, which is pretty cool, you can listen to the radio on the fly now, comes with all of this stuff here. Um, this seems like a pretty good option. Two thumbs up from Family 4. Thanks for watching.